Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, I will show you how to highlight a screenshot on a Mac. Let's get started. The steps are going to be the same for all Mac machines. Now, for demonstration purposes, I have already taken a screenshot, which I've named Screenshot1. As you can see, I have taken the screenshot of the settings page. Let's proceed with highlighting it. What if I want to highlight some parts in this particular screenshot? For that, all you need to do is just select the screenshot by single tapping on your mouse or trackpad. Right click, then select the Open With option and open it with Preview. Now, once you open Preview, this is how the Preview application looks. You can make it full screen for easier viewing. Let's say, for example, if I want to highlight this particular part over here. For that, all you need to do is go and select the Markup Toolbar over here, the one with the circular icon and the marker icon. Just select this option, and you will get multiple options. First, you need to select a shape. To do this, click on the drop-down menu next to the Shapes icon. You will see multiple options, including rectangles, circles, lines, and arrows. Select the shape you want to use for highlighting. You have the option to choose a square, circle, message icon, and many more. Let's say you select the square option. It will appear on your screenshot. To adjust it, simply click and drag the edges or corners to resize and reposition it as needed. Now, currently, the opacity is set to less than 50%. I'll explain how to adjust that later. First, when you add any particular shape, you just need to select and adjust the size as per your requirement. You can do this by clicking and dragging the edges or corners of the shape. So this is how I want to highlight my screenshot, emphasizing this particular area after adjusting everything. If you want to change the color of the border, you can do so. Currently, the border color is pink, so if you want to change it to black or another color, you can select the border option here, then choose from multiple colors available in the dropdown. For instance, if you prefer the border color to be red, you can select the red option, and now you can see the border color has been changed. If you want to change the fill color inside of the highlighted area, you can select the fill color option next to the border color. Click on the dropdown, and you can choose a different color from the options available. So let's say you want to use yellow as the fill color. Now you can see that the yellow fill color makes it difficult to see the background. To fix this, you can adjust the opacity of the fill color. Click on the fill color dropdown again and select show colors from the options. This will open the color panel where you can adjust the opacity slider to make the fill color more transparent, allowing you to see the background content more clearly. And then you need to adjust the opacity. Select the opacity toggle and move the slider to increase or decrease the opacity level. For example, if you want the opacity around 55%, adjust the slider accordingly until you reach your desired transparency level. Once set, your highlighted area will be more transparent, allowing the background content to be visible. This is how you can highlight parts of a screenshot on your Mac. Now, if you want to save it, you can just go in File option over here in the menu bar and then select Save. After making your edits and highlighting the parts you want in preview on your Mac, simply save the edited screenshot with a new file name. This way, you keep the original screenshot unchanged and have a separate file with the highlighted or edited version. So yeah, uh, that's how simple it is to highlight your screenshot in your Mac. If you found this tutorial helpful, feel free to like the video and subscribe for more content. Thank you for watching.